Alrighty guys, we're on one. And take a couple of these. So right now what I'm doing, <clears throat> I'm just kind of throwing a couple of little things in here in my tackle boxes. I got jigs here that I hopefully would think that these would work, not too sure. So I'm gonna try that. We got some worms and I think that's all I need. Oh, I got a couple more uh, smaller, one small, one big size Wahoo spinnerbait. It's kind of what I'm trying today. I think I got everything. Oh no, you know what? Listen, this is color right here. And I'm just gonna take two of these as well. Oh, make it three. I went to uh, Academy yesterday, just bought some miscellaneous things. You let me know if you've used these or not. I wanted to hook up, and I don't think I got the right color choice, but I wanted to put this and this together. Would y'all use that? Or where y'all fish at? Let me know. Um, so I put this box real quick together. I know it's kind of messy, but It'll work for me for right now so I can So far, walked uh, up the creek or river, lake, whatever you want to call this, and haven't been able to find any bass. Nothing really moving over here. I'm gonna start heading back and uh, see what I find. Maybe when I head back, start again about that breakfast time where I'm hungry. So. I'm gonna show you what I've been throwing or I started throwing. Maybe let me know it's good, bad. On well, the over here the ground's muddy. But this is what I'm throwing right now. Uh it's a three quarter ounce weight or half ounce weight, three quarter ounce weight I believe it is. Um send it up with my Grande Bass Snake -o. So let's see if I can get it over here. About two feet, three feet over here on this side, on right side on this edge. So I already lost one jig. Let me know if I'm moving in too fast, reeling in too quickly, stuck in a tree. There we go. I'm just kind of filling the bottom right here. Feels like a bunch of twigs, things like that. Pause. I like this back area more. It's a little, little smaller. Uh, I saw from another 
YouTuber that was fishing in a small, looked like a little uh, creek area or river. And uh, he was casting to the other side. Uh, I believe it was keeping it real or no, last cast. I believe I, I had to double check on his, but I'll post the, uh, the link below from the ideas I got kind of from him. Unfortunately, I forgot my uh, my weights that were, or not my weights, but my hooks that were for my my weightless worms. So everything I've been using has kind of been either a swim jig or off the bottom. Alrighty, what I like to do is today I'm going to use something a little bit different. I'm going to use some shrimp. And I normally don't use shrimp, uh, use a lot of uh, crawfish and and mullet out here. Shrimp down here, just give it a little squeeze. And I'm going to put on my bugs uh, rabbit hair, magic treble, just add a little bit. Okay, so right now we're in 11 feet of water. We're gonna cast it out. Set a troll. Bait number two. Now this one I'm gonna do something different. We're gonna add, we're gonna add some crawfish to this one. Crawfish, whoa. It's already hot today. Now on this line, I'm using a, uh, it's a 20 pound floral um, leader and I used a FG knot. I wanted to see how it's going to hold up. I've never used this lure or this knot before. And you can probably see right there. FG knot. So what I'm going to do is we're going to cast this one out. Release the bell. And... Move a little faster too because I'm in five feet of water. Right here there's a little there's a little uh pump. What happened? Just lost a run right now, so it hit it and let go. I'm gonna turn around, go back again, see if I can cross over this path path again. So 
a little bit of a slow day I'm finding them they're uh, 15 about 15 feet down let me see if I can get another one All right, guys. we're on one Oh, oh. Don't want to do that. Here it comes. I'm still moving forward because I have another line out. Here it comes. It's like a red. It feels like a red. Oh, it's a red. Come on. Got him. It's a nice size red. Now, there we go. Now, how big this is? I have no idea. It's over 20 inches. Say it's a keeper. It's been a little fight. Ready? There you go, man. Thank you very much. It was fun.